Hey guys, let me just first say I am sorry for this horrible lighting. It's like about five o'clock. My cat, if you can hear my cat, I'm sorry. He's she's decided to go insane today. But I'm sorry for this horrible lighting. It's getting dark outside, so I don't have any natural light, so I'm just using the little um light from my fan. This is finally going to be my breastfeeding versus formula feeding video that I have probably needed to put up for like a month, but it's finally going to go up today. So before you watch this video, you might want to watch my breastfeeding journey video, which I'll have linked in the description box below, because then you'll get to see kind of how my journey was and kind of why I've come to these opinions of breastfeeding versus formula feeding. But, anyways, just to get started, people tend to say that breastfeeding is so much better than formula feeding. If you feed your child formula, you're a bad parent, there's something wrong with you, blah, 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 blah. And breastfeeding is really good. It's good for your baby. And people people look at the benefits of it and I guess that's why they feel it's okay to put other people down but it's really the benefits are good but I really don't think they're worth sitting there and arguing over breast milk um, it helps fight off infections it decreases the chance for obesity and diabetes and it's a lot easier for the baby to digest but those are absolutely not reasons to hate on someone for feeding their child formula so I guess if you want to hear kind of my flat out opinion, if you can breastfeed, I do think you should try. If you don't want to just straight nurse, I think you should pump at least for a little while. I'd need to quit doing that. <laughs> I'm fanning myself. But I think you should try. But if you choose not to, if you choose to formula feed, I'm not going to go on your page and sit behind a computer and type, I mean, you're such a bad mom. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're doing that. You're like killing your child. I'm not going to do that because I think that's ridiculous. There are so many bigger issues than whether you breastfeed or formula feed your child. Vaccinations, that's something a lot more important than fighting over um, what kind of milk your child is getting. Tiggy, stop interfering. Um, car seat safety, absolutely a lot more important to make sure your child is buckled in right in the right car seat. Um, and just paying enough attention attention to your child and taking care of them and loving them and providing for them are way more important things to worry about than if your child is getting breast milk or not. Another thing people don't realize is that breastfeeding can be really hard sometimes, um, harder on some people than others. For me, um, again, you'll probably want to watch my video for the full detail and everything but it's been kind of a struggle especially with I'm working and going to school and if you're not pumping or breastfeeding quite often your supply will stabilize and your body thinks okay this is all she wants me uh, to produce and that's how much your body's going to produce and I guess there are probably ways that you can get that to go up but they don't always work for everyone and they don't always work well so it can be really hard and some people their body just decides nope not gonna make milk and nope I'm just gonna stop producing milk it doesn't work perfectly for everyone the way some people think it does what's really important to realize is that formula is not only um, food for your child it's specifically made for babies they've made it to where babies can digest it it's very um, I don't know, it's fitted for babies, it's not for adults to eat, uh, it's not like you're feeding your child cow's milk, which is very, very hard for them to digest, or solid foods, which some people decide it's okay to crush them up and start feeding their two-month-old, three-month-old solid foods. Sorry, my cat. But, it's not solid foods, it's not cow's milk, it's formula. It is made for the newest of newborns, so... You are not poisoning your baby by feeding them food that was made by, for babies. I guarantee you if you talk to um, 50 people, 
uh, I don't know, I can't give you like obviously an exact percentage, but I guarantee you a large portion of them were probably formula fed. And I guarantee you that they also turned out fine. They weren't starved to death and they're not dead. So, um, formula is okay. Formula is not going to kill you. So, my main point in all this is if your child is fed and they're healthy and they're happy, then you are doing just fine. You don't have to breastfeed your child just because somebody put you down for formula feeding them. You don't need to feel bad about it. If you choose to formula feed from the start, that's your decision. You're not hurting your baby. The only thing you're doing is just not giving them those extra nutrients, which as adults, we don't even necessarily completely take care of our bodies the way we should. Um, a baby cannot choose for themselves, so it is good to give them those extra things while they're little. But again, you're not hurting them by giving them formula. And in fact, you're helping them grow. So that's my opinion. And don't leave any hate comments because I don't read them or I don't, I just ignore them and delete them. So thanks for watching. Thanks for being subscribed if you're not subscribe down there